So pretty basic start here, and then uh, it immediately just gets fucked up. Very fucked up. So obviously dive storage, use that. Um, and then you're gonna end up with a few different speeds. Mod 6. So, you know, you can only slow down in increments of six speed at a time. So, uh, you're gonna wanna do different things depending on your lowest possible speed that you slow down to, which is your speed mod six. Now, if it's uh, zero mod six, then it's pretty straightforward. Just like slow down on the way up and then just go straight up and then tap forward and get out of there. Um, but if you have like four speed like there, you have to tap B like halfway up so that you don't hit the right wall. And then time it so you don't hit the left wall either. And then tap forward to get out of there. Uh, if you get lucky enough to get two speed, then you just go and it works. And then you use a bunch of D-pad flicks to fly in place, um, but your speed is even now because uh, all of the movements that you do with cape are in multiples of two. And you just bonked a wall earlier, which set your speed to zero. So um, now it's even, it stays even. Uh, what you can do is you can uh, go slow enough and then tap B three times in order to swap your parity from even to odd um, by using uh, the way speed oscillation works. Um, essentially, once you hit the speed cap of minus eight, uh, once you try and tap B again, it uh, subtracts one instead of adding six uh, to your leftward speed. Um, and then you're doing a bunch of really careful uh, Backwards cape pumps and then um, tapping B exactly twice so that, uh, cause. So you wanna get back to one speed, right? Um, so you're worried about your mod four speed there. Uh, cause when you tap forward, that's in increments of four. So you want to be sure to uh, tap B enough times. Six is two mod four, so you want to hit B twice so that it's possible to get back to one speed. So back from uh, one mod four to three mod four and then back to one mod four. And that's how you get up here. So you want to like get one speed, tap B, uh, and then do a d-pad flick and then tap B and just repeatedly do that. Sometimes you have to like save it because your d-pad flick isn't exactly three frames. <laughs> Vanilla turnaround is not the only thing you're terrified of with cape. Yeah, there's a lot going on here and uh, you can see there's a Yoshi later too. So this is another parody swap you want to um, tap B three times from a low enough speed in order to uh, oscillate your speed again. That'll change it from uh, like odd speed to an even speed. And with an even speed, it's possible to get zero speed. You need zero speed to drop down through that one tile hole to get to Yoshi. Yeah, Cape is really, really in depth. I've just been like diving into the deep end with Pogio's harder shit recently and absolutely loving how much depth there is to it. Okay, then you do a backwards pump to recover zero speed. Uh, and then um, swapping your parity with Yoshi is actually a little bit more tricky because you got to be holding the opposite direction to which you're facing. And you got to be moving um, 
the opposite direction to which you're facing with at least eight speed and you got to tap B. So the uh, basically the only time that you're doing that all of those line up is when you're doing tongueless flight and right at the start of your tongueless flight input is when you want to um, tap B. So like uh, say you're moving right, you're facing left, uh, you press right and then left to do a tongueless pump. Um, with that tongueless pump, you want to press B right as you start pressing right, uh, right at the start of that tongueless pump input. So yeah, tap B right at the start of that cape pump. Uh, that didn't work. This is two speed, so I got to do that again. Get at least eight speed and then... Tap B right at the start. Okay, this is one speed. So you need one speed uh, to be able to get through this part. And then you just do... Just keep that one speed and... Be really good with your timing so you can squeeze all the way up through this part. Fuck. Kind of hard. Um, I intentionally don't include an X speed display. Uh, if people want to play it with tools like the SMW TAS Lua, they can feel free to. Or if they want to patch that in themselves, I'm not opposed. But yeah, part of the um, skill involved with uh, this kind of cape stuff is that you've got to uh, be able to tell what speed you're going and react based on that. and. Uh, do any specific inputs based on that. Oh yeah, this is the not final version of the level where there's that extra tile sticking out and rendering a whole new chunk of the level because of it. Whoops. That's the whole level. Kind of fucked up. <laughs> but that's the level.